Hello there, my name is Ra and welcome back to my Open TTD Challenge series. We are in the first season and the sixth episode. And last episode we made a big steel line. We connected the iron farms to the steel mill, the steel mill to the factory and the factory to the city. And that is all making us nice amounts of money. Some of the iron farms still had to up their production a bit. But those probably will go up in the upcoming years. And for this episode, well, there isn't really a plan. Uh, I didn't have any time between episodes to play. So we are starting off at, uh, well, exactly the same date as we ended the last episode. So for what is about to happen in this episode, uh, I do not know. Because as I said, there is no plan for today. And we are going to play and see what happens this episode. There are a few things. We are nearly in the year 1800. We are one year away. And we are about 4 million shy of the 100 million mark. Which we will probably hit this year, I assume. Let's see. We are making 4.5 million a year. So yeah, we are gonna hit the 1 million mark before the end of the year. So let's unpause the game and start the episode without a plan. And let's fast forward the game as well, as we usually do. And let's first take a look at the ships, how they are doing. We want to sort by profit last year. And the iron ore we can skip. Uh, making money, making money. Is there one that is losing a lot of money? We have a passenger ship in the depot. I forgot to remove this one. Okay. That is resolved. Then we have a grain ship. That. Yeah, that isn't gonna make any money no the production is way too low for that to make money mm, yeah what can we do uh, we can resolve this if we pull in another farm we have two here one here and one here how's the production that is pretty high and this even higher um, so if we take the grain and livestock from this farm to this one, transfer it. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay, so first we need to make a channel, of course. Uh, we need uh, close this one. We need this one. Well, how are we going to? ship it and we first need to make sure that we can put in the dock before we go any further like that and yes now you go uh, even like that do we go around the town or if, no, let's go in front of the town. Uh, we can do it like this as well. And then let's go that way. So we now have surpassed the 100 million. That is quite a nice feat from 1700. But I must say that I was suspecting a harder challenge for this. Perhaps the decisions made with various uh, cargoes were uh, pretty good decisions. But I, I did a test and that was way harder. Or it seemed way harder. Now that being said, we are going to have challenges later on with the, the train tracks, uh, the high maintenance on that. And the airports, including noise limits that towns have. Um, that will be the first time that I play with that. So. We we're gonna see that later how that works out. That potentially is gonna going to cost us a bit more. Uh, but until now the challenge is 
well, medium in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. I also, what I also want to do at this point is up the uh, world recession. No, not up the world recession. Uh, what I want to do is up the ship limit as suggested in the comments. I am going to up the ship limit by 500. Limitations. So we are now at 600 and we are going to 1100. So we have uh, quite a way to go before we hit the maximum. And let's up this as well. Because this was also double. I doubled all the uh, maximum number, but we can triple it. And perhaps even more, but let's triple it first and see where we get from with that. Okay, so this one is ready. Well, I was blabbering on. Uh, we need a depot, we need a buoy, do we? Yeah, let's place a buoy right there. Oh, not there. That one. Okay, we want a ship that um, delivers a livestock. And this is the old ship, we want this one. Buy and refit, then full load at the docks, service at the nearest depot, go to the buoy, then go to there and we need to transfer the goods there, and then again the depot, the buoy and it will go back to the first order. So that was a livestock ship. Now we need one for grain. And we are just going to share the orders with this ship. Like that. And let's put them in the correct groups. And this was livestock. This was livestock, yes. And this is grain. Okay. Right. Okay, so clone you uh, four times because it's a big producer. No, four times, and that one four times. Let's see where we get with this. Production is go has gone down quite a lot actually, but that will probably go up again since we have the ships here. Uh, we have. And we have loads and loads of livestock waiting here. So let's clone this ship. Again with shared orders of course. And let's clone you some more. Because there's more livestock coming in as well. What we also need to do is up the goods here probably. We have a few ships waiting. And no goods at the moment. But we are going to get a train of ships. The recession is over. We felt that in our wallet. Wow. <laughs> it was a big recession. Um, hey, new ship. I'll get to this in a moment. But we actually made a lot less profit than last year yeah profit and a lot less income we have purchased some new vehicles but we have now 1.3 million less in income so the recession did hit us not as big but it did hit us um yeah okay uh, this ship Available ships. We have. Oh, it's a small one. Okay. Uh, break. So, what? It's the same price. Oh, the speed is higher. It goes a bit faster. And it costs less to run. But it also moves 10 crates of goods less. Uh. 
No, we don't have, want that. That's not going to be necessary. Uh, and pause the game again. First ships here are on their way. These are still loading. The production is up. Uh, let's just clone two ships more from each just in case. Uh, that is this one resolved. Except for the fact that we don't have enough grain ships here. Uh, we need this one. Yeah, we need this one to clone. And let's clone you. For how many ships do we have here? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. And uh, we have six here, so let's do seven as well. All right, on your way you go. Well, the man without the plan. <laughs> let's let's see what we can do. Let's take a look, and you know what? I actually like the farms at the moment. And in fact, here are five farms, six farms, pretty nice and neat near to each other. How much are they producing? Quite enough grain. Also grain. Livestock is okay, grain is okay. This one, livestock is pretty good. And this one, livestock is even better. Uh, we have one here, which is another grain, okay? So we have those, and then we have a factory here, here, and here. We probably make the most amount of money if we go to this one uh, another year that way yeah we're going to this factory and we are going to start with the nearest one so let's do that as the first step can we grab that yes we can That's brilliant and let's put in a buoy around here. Oh, forgot the depot. You do not want to forget the depot. New ships. We want this one and we want grain. Forgot. To, no, this is the new one. Grain, yes. And you want to full out there. Nearest depot. Buoy. And unload there, depot. And oh, back over the buoy. Back over the buoy. Okay, so it's in the right category. We want, so many are you producing? Quite a lot. Let's do four ships and a fifth one, but we want this one to be livestock. So from the new ships 597 nine, 7 is livestock okay, and one more on your way you go right so that's one sorted out this one is quite easy as well yeah let's do two separate stations uh, that's not even close. And this is not close enough. Uh, let's focus on this one first. Uh, depot. We want to, from there to there. Let's put the buoy right here. And we can go from there and there. Yeah, it's one buoy. It's quite alright. Okay. Clone a ship. We want you. We can delete all of this. 
uh, full out and dead dock depot buoy dock oh no dock depot and buoy again uh, this was a grain ship Two, three, four. how much was this producing this has more livestock okay this livestock Oh, goods and passengers is losing money. Uh, we want ship 605. This is livestock. And we want to clone you five times. There we go. Okay, so those are going. How much did this one earn? Uh, so about seven grand probably. Next one. Yeah, well the trouble is how are we doing this? Um, yeah, let's just do it like this. Uh, oh no, let's do it smart. Do it on the edge right here. So we need to do this. The depot can be right here. Uh, docks. Yes. Now we can clone these ships. And only remove this one. And replace that with this one. The rest is the same. This was a grain farm. Ah, uh, 50-50. Uh, let's do four and four. This livestock. This livestock. Let's clone uh, the green ship. And give that shared orders with this one. One, two, three. And uh, on your way you go. Another one done. I want to see how much this one is going to make. Um, it's probably the best way to do it like this. And like that. Oh, like that. Oh, come on. Yeah. And we need to raise the land here. And we can do that. And I didn't see how much this one is bringing in. Uh, also uh, 7500 thereabouts. The grain 8000 plus. Uh, this is gonna be a good one. Before we continue on the other side Let's first set up the, oh, no, not clone. Let's first set up the goods uh, ships. Because this is producing now. Okay, uh, go to there. Where do we even want to go? Let's see, there is a big town right here. Yeah, that is the easiest route. So let's do that. Hopefully we can get goods at the shore. And we do. Uh, let's do it right here. And then we have valuables as well. For later on perhaps. Let's do it like that. And... extra buoy right there okay so we were full loading there then to the depot then to the buoy then to the other buoy go to there uh, depot buoy mm, buoy yeah. okay. uh, put this in the correct group goods and 
build. So now we're gonna need a whole lot of ships for this. There we go. First one are on their way. Okay, what we want to do at this side is place a, a lock. Okay, that's a lock. To place a lock. Let's remove that and do that. Clone this one and clone that one. Remove this order and replace it with this one. And we can do shared orders and we are done. Right, uh, how much was this producing? Also about 50-50, so... <laughs> like that. Okay. Those are on their way as well. Goods are waiting here. Production is double at the moment. So that's good. That will go up even more when we connect or when the first ships arrive from this one. And we need to connect this as well. So grain and livestock. And we need that. Depot on the outside. There we go. Right, so now we can do the same trick. We need one of that and one of that. And we need to replace this one with a full lot on that one. And then share your orders with him. Oh, no. Let's clone them first. <laughs> Forgot to clone them. Right, so those are all on their way. Now we have one farm left right there. Are we doing all right? Yes, we are. Okay, let's do this one. And, uh, mm, yeah, what's the best way? Let's, yeah, let's just do it this way. On the edge and on the edge right here. Just like that. And before we continue doing that, let's first put in the dock. Alright, all is cleared. And now we can do the big stuff. And we want to go from here. And we go over a beach. Let's go one to the side. This will replant some on this side, so that will be fine. And we need one extra buoy in between. Let's do it there. And we need to clone one of you and one of you this remove this one before we go to plant town let's go to that one and on the way back exactly the same uh, from there 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 yeah, this is correct. Uh, share the orders and then clone. Right, on your way you go. So, those are all connected. Oh, we even have one here that isn't producing that much. Well, let let's leave that for now we can always do that later so how are we doing on goods <laughs> uh, 
we need a little bit more ships. And livestock, livestock, livestock goods here. Clone that one. And like that's the train of ships. Right, so let's leave this going for a while and we will get back to that. This one was losing money last year. There are a few that aren't making money. And why is that? These guys are full loading, refitting. Oh, these are refitting for passengers, yes. There aren't that many passengers here. Neither are here. Ah, we don't have enough goods here because we don't have enough steel coming in. Okay. Uh, let's get to this side. So one of two things. Either there are too many ships or delivery of iron ore isn't good so we need to check the iron ore mines first and see how that production is going uh, those are waiting those are waiting okay we have trouble with the uh, supply of iron ore do we still have two mines here yes we have Production isn't that high. Hmm. That is a problem. Oh, is this one also low? So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, let's remove some steel ships and some good ships as well. And that is going to be it for this episode, folks. Despite the fact that this was the episode without a plan, um, we did quite a lot, actually. We made this whole new farm to factory to city line, which is going quite well. We also solved the issue with this transport line by transferring new grain and livestock from another farm. And that is also making us more and more money. So again, it is all going quite, quite well. If we have a look at the finance, you can see that we spent 17 million on new vehicles. That is because all the merchantman ships are now gone. They are all replaced by uh, the new one. And that did cost us a lot of money. However, that will also make us even more money. So that's a nice trade-off. Uh, we are now in the year 1810. So, and what I want to do for next episode is to speed this along and uh, go to the year in which we have the trams. That is 62 years in the future. I will have a look if there is something interesting going on in those years while playing and I will record that. But for now the plan is to get along to the trams and see what we can do from there. That all being said, this is the end for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. And also, if you are not already subscribed, subscribe to the channel, turn on your notifications, so you don't miss out on any new video. And with that, have a great day, stay safe, and see you next time. Bye-bye.